Horses prating postward, race number six, the second elimination. Three-old Philly Trotters in the Pride of Ohio Philly Trots. Racing a mile, a purse of $12,522, a fill of six, and here is the lineup. The one is a carry the message fillet. Oh, by Leroy Amos of the Bar Ohio at Thomas the Trainer with a three-year record of 205 at Pasiris. Earnings of $26,000. Dave Miller driving. Salmania. The two is a Ditto Hanover filly owned by Don McCurgan of Northfield and Carter Jr. Brunswick, Ohio. Don McCurgan is the trainer. She has a two-year-old record right here at the Cider Downs in Ohio State Fair Stakes. 202 and two, 202 and three rather. Fifty-five thousand dollars in earnings. Don McCurgan back driving Lizzie Brown. The three Stone King filly. Oh, then trained by Pius Sondland of Canton, Ohio with a three-year-old record at Northfield Park, 202 flat. That her last start at Ohio Fair Sticks. She has earnings of $21,000. Joe Adamski driving, flowery. The four is an Ombro Elliott filly, owned by Nita Sickles of Union City, Indiana. Dave Brumbaugh trains with a mark, 205 at Washington Courthouse. Her last start in Ohio Fair Sticks, earnings of $5,300. Jay Cross driving, the Purple Lady. Number five is a Lucky Almahurst filly owned by Dean Davis of Worcester. Kurt Sung, the uh, trainer, with a three-year-old mark, 201 and 1, earnings $41,000. Jeff out driving, date book. And from the outside, post six, it's a carry the message filly owned by Harold Breidenbaugh of Lima. Harold Dick is the trainer with a three-year-old Bastard Raceway Park, 201 and 1 fifth, earnings of $67,000. Harold Dick driving, attitude dance. There's your field for the sixth race. Second elimination. Uh, three of the Philly Trotters are all in behind the gate. They're on the back stretch and approaching the start. And uh, they're off. And first away, it's the five date book who sent for the lead. Added to dance is right there with her. From the inside, uh, racing a three, uh, Salmania to the inside and fourth comes Lizzie Brown. At the middle and fifth, it's Flowery. The early trailer sixth is the Purple Lady. Round the first turn and added to dance is off stride here and added to dance is on a break here. Relaxing a bit too much after making the front and added to dance. A costly break on the inside and now inheriting the lead. It's date book. The opening quarter, 29 seconds. And now the leader is the 11 to 1 date book who leads by two. Salmini to the inside is second and Flowery quickly taking advantage is now moving and underway third. At the rail and fourth is Lizzie Brown. The fifth is the Purple Lady and the trailer now is added to Dance who recovered quickly but a bit too late here as they approach the half now Flowery and Adamski has made the front up by two with date book again in the garden spot the half in 59 and two to the back stretch and Salmania is trotting a third at the red and fourth is Lizzie Brown and the purple lady coming first up of the outside trotting fifth they straighten out down the back stretch and Flowery in control here. She leads by two, two and a half. Date book of the inside is second. Salmania trots third. And the purple lady on the outside is fourth. Added to dance back at a contention is fifth. And off stride is Lizzie Brown. Into the final turn they go and Flowery. A comfortable eight here by two and a half. Three quarters, 130. And on the inside and trotting a second. It's date book. The purple lady is there stalking the leader within striking distance. Here comes added to dance. Back of the outside, and at the rail of Salmania. Now lost an eighth of a mile to go, and down the stretch they come, and it's Flowery with the lead. Date book down to the inside, and the Purple Lady on the outside is trotting a third, and she's showing some late trot, but in the deep stretch, it's Flowery, Date book, and the Purple Lady. Three of them at the wire together. Here, ladies and gentlemen, is the official winner, the second elimination of the Pride of Ohio Philly Trot, number three, Flowery, a daughter of Stone King, from the White Crown, Mighty Crown Mare, Wheat Flower. She's a homebred, owned and trained by Pius Sondland of Canton, Ohio, handled tonight by Joe Adamski, Flowery, coming in from Medina, recording her fourth 
win of the season. That is a career mark for her. The mile in two minutes flat for driver Joe Adamski. Two wins this evening. That gives him a driving double. Here's the order finish. Salmania four, Leslie Brown six, Flowery the winner, the Purple Lady three, Date Book two, added two dance five, four, six, one, three, two, five. In the upcoming is seventh race, the third and final elimination of the Pride of Ohio Philly Trot. Scratch number six, Bow. The six horse bow has been scratched sick.